Hi everyone, Sean with jazbeescasebreaks.com here doing 2021 Top Series 1 Jumbo 6 box case break. Pick your team number 3 where we're giving away a Tops Rip Party pack to one person in the break. So, all cards ship. At the end of the break, we'll randomize all 30 customers' names. Top name wins an exclusive Rip Party pack with the silver foil stamp. And it's 5 cards out of the 330 card base set, all numbered to 10. So nice stuff. Uh, here is our customer list and their corresponding teams from Spiro, Falasakos, and the Diamondbacks down to Super Fracture Hunter and the Washington Nationals. There's our case. Here is the list in person. There you go. So we're going to pop up in this case, rip open boxes, and go through the hits. This will likely be my last break of the night slash morning, but we got plenty more coming up. Jason will be coming in here around eight o'clock ish to do the morning. And then Joe will come in to do his regular one o'clock to nine o'clock. And I'll be back at nine o'clock tonight. Let's do it all over again. So we got at least 30 hours of straight streaming for you guys. After midnight, it all depends on if you guys keep me here. So Plenty to look forward to. Mm, I don't know, Chad. I mean... If it sells out well as a pick your team, maybe not. All depends on how much we get as far as cases and stuff like that, though. You know? But yeah, if, if it's if it keeps selling out as a as a pick your team, then unlikely that we'll we'll do it to that other one. But who knows? Just keep an eye on the site. Anything can happen. Yes, sir. Always. I, I know, Chad. Trust me, I know. But that's the thing. is like... It's a lot. But it's still obviously within reason because people are buying them, right? So. So, I think if if those teams weren't moving and like, you know. It would sort of struggle to fill them and whatever, and they were just sitting there. Then, obviously, maybe they start moving them to random teams so that all of that will start to move because then every opportunity, every spot gets you a chance at those teams. But with them selling straight up, oh, of course, yeah. But that's why if you do stuff like that, Chad, you don't buy them in just one break. You know what I mean? Like you buy them in all the breaks. <laughs> Or a lot of them. Yeah. Yeah. And that's the thing. Is like, it's not just a. Oh, I'm going to take a shot of them in this one break. It's I'm going to take a shot of them and I'm really going to make sure I get it in all of them. You know.
So you got three Deshaun autos? Nice, Chad. Congrats, man. Yeah, I mean, that's where, like, knowing the checklist on stuff like that is pretty, pretty good play. There's always good value, even in some of those, you know, lower price teams. I mean, what was it? Yeah. I, I know, Chad. I have that same problem with the Charger stuff that I have. I purchased a, I purchased a very nice uh, Justin Herbert rookie auto at the beginning of the season before he had played. Um, that's numbered out of eight. <laughs> and then the very next week, he was the starting quarterback. And fast forward, and now he's rookie of the year. Um, and it's appreciated in value considerably. The only problem is I'm a Chargers fan. I'm not selling it, so I'm screwed. Exactly. It makes it really tough. It makes it really tough. And that's why I've started to look at players for teams that I want to collect that I like think will do well and their value will go up, but I have no problem selling it as soon as it does go up. You know what I mean? Like teams that I don't cheer for or root for or anything like that. <clears throat> So that's my new approach. Keep my PC stuff, but uh, start collecting on value players that I think will be good. And their value will also go up, but it makes it easy for me just to be able to like, yep, I can sell that. So. There's no personal connection to the person or to the team. The only thing I'll do is check box scores to see how they did. That's it. Yeah, see? Where are you getting those numbers, Joe? I think it's a good one, Chad. I think it's a real good one. Based on the odds. Checklist odds. Okay. So basically, numbered parallels are your go-to? Yeah, for sure. No, no, I get, I get it, Joe. I haven't looked at anything or tried to look or even tried to calculate it, so...
mean, I think the safe bet's always been go for the numbered parallels, right? Uh, Rob, this is Pick Your Team 3. Uh, Pick Your Team 2 just finished a little while ago and is probably still being uploaded. Parallels and SP, so figure means. Yeah, I mean, if, if overall production is up, but the parallels are still numbered to the same and there's not more parallels, then yeah, I mean, it would be harder to pull those, you know? This is box number six. This isn't what people are trying are, are like scooping up the entire shelf of though, you know, Joe, and throwing it into their shopping cart. Like, I don't think this is the problem stuff. I'm, nothing surprises me anymore. <laughs> nothing surprises me anymore. But I think I think more than anything, I think if it's not on the shelf, it's because there's so many people uh, that are collecting now. You know what I mean? I'm not even trying to flip it. Like legitimately, people are collecting three, six, nine, twelve, which is good. Um, we've had some foil and stuff like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see. Hit you a Rocky, TJ? You got it, dude. You ask, I deliver. Yeah, honestly, I, I think it's... I, I like to look at it as there's that just many, that many more people. Eyes on the, on it now. Bobby Dahlbeck for the Red Sox. Alex Valasakos. Let's get it on. John Lester. Short print for the Cubbies. Gregory Borod. I remember, guys, all card ship. Which, disclaimer, please give us a little bit of extra time to sort and ship these out to you guys. Joe Adele for the Angels, Alex Velasacos. Uh, Casey Mize and Sixto Sanchez. Casey Mize for the Tigers, Anthony Kunkel. Sixto Sanchez going to the Marlins, Ryan Harold. Because of how great, thank you Tops again, uh, for them letting us do this part of this rip party. Because of how much we're doing, uh, we're literally going to have 30 hours straight at minimum 30 hours straight of of streaming we started at six o'clock yesterday we will not end until at least midnight tonight so understand there may be a little bit of delay in shipping and sorting of these but please bear with us it will all be worth it and like i said all card ship
Juan Soto Relic for Washington, Super Fractor Hunter. Uh, I, I'm sure we will, Steelers fan. Rebel, I'm not sure. I mean, how many do we have on the site already? We've already done a lot. We've got a lot more to do. So somewhere between a lot and a lot more. Ryan Mountcastle, Orioles, Richard Zitterman. Jake Odorizzi, gold to 2021 for the Twins, Brian Wilk. <laughs> Trust me, they're already working extra hours. It's easier to open this than it is to sort it. Isaac Paredes, foil rookie for the Tigers. Anthony Kunkel. I want to see that too. Let's see if we can find it in this. I just want to see. I still want to find an ultra short print. First year that they've called it an ultra short print. Let's find that. Okay, that's the first half of box number one. Oh, I think I think so too, man. Yeah, let me know, Shiny. I think you should be okay. You should I, th I think you should I, I think you got, you're gonna be successful. I got faith for you. Hey, I'm on air. I'm on air right now. Okay, I'll feed him when I get home. Why? Okay. Okay. Ah, uh -huh, bye. Right, Tony? <laughs> Ryan Mountcastle. Shane Bieber. 270 for the Indians. That's going to Russell Thompson. Good morning, by the way, Tony. How are you? Uh, typically 8 o'clock, I think, Joe. Maybe somebody else. Christian Pache for the Braves, Eric Ainge. Isaac Paredes, gold foil for the Tigers. Anthony Kunkel. And gold, Luis Garcia, rookie to 2021 for Super Fractor Hunter, Washington. 
Yeah, that's what I thought too. It should give you a countdown, doesn't it? Tell you when it's live. Joey Bart for the Giants. Deborah Close, last spot mojo. Christian Pache, silver foil. Rookie for the Braves, Eric Ainge. And rookie auto, Sam Huff for the Texas Rangers, Steven Surrey. Oh, it's not even up? Hmm. Interesting. Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. Francisco Hernandez. Alec Baum for the Phillies. Uh, Scott Rakefis. And Dylan Carlson for the Cardinals. Daniel Yu. I think those are all the big names. At least I've said the name and those teams that they're going to and the respective owners um, on there. Those are typically, like, those are the bigger names, the rookies that we were kind of paying attention to. Jorge Soler, home run challenge. I don't think I missed anybody. There's other good ones in here. Brady Singer. Um, K. Brian Hayes. Lots of other people. Oh, why am I starting? I gotta put this one away first. Come on. So that's box one. Interesting. Exactly. <laughs> Christian Pache. Joey Bart, Dylan Carlson. Interesting. Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. Alec Baum for the Phillies. Does Montgomery, even on regular stuff, get a day early on that? I didn't think they did. I'm not part of it, though. Jesse Winkler. Gold to 2021 for the Reds. Henry Bramblett. And Paul DeYoung. Relic. For the Cardinals. Daniel Yu. Oh, you know what? The one name I haven't seen yet. Right there. Joe Adele. Um, I mean, there's actually a bunch, Joe. It's it, This is a really loaded rookie class. Really loaded rookie class. So, there's a lot of good names in here. Bobby Dahlbeck. Red Sox. Yeah, 
Yeah, last year's was really good too. Joe Adele, Angels. Casey Mize, Tigers, Sixto Sanchez, Marlins. I mean, there's there's honestly so many good rookies in this class that like even the one the names of the rookies that I'm not like pulling out or and saying their names are actually really good rookies too. Nate Pearson, that guy's great, crazy. Well, there's a lot of really good names in here. So that's the first half of box number two. Yeah, I was actually, I mean, it was funny. is when, when they released the checklist, I was going through it. I was like, damn, that guy's in here. Christian Pache. I was like, wow. Okay, Alex Baum. Okay. Joe Adele. Okay. It was just like, man, it just doesn't stop. Bobby Dobbeck. Joe Adele. Francisco Lindor for the Indians. Russell Thompson. I think they, I mean, honestly, Shiny. I think it's because they also know that the class of rookies that's coming up behind them, Casey Mize, Sixto Sanchez, is really good and pretty close on their heels. So Series 2 and Update this year is going to be pretty crazy. Um, Cronenworth should be in Series 2, I think. Uh, I don't think they're holding him till Update. But yeah, I, I was actually surprised Cronenworth wasn't in there. But Luis Patino, that's already a good one for the Padres. John Gray, Father's Day to 50 for the Rockies. There you go, TJ. Tarek Skubal for the Tigers, another good one. Ryan Mountcastle. Yeah, that was the guy. Like we kept naming people that were in the first, and then somebody was like, "What about Ryan Mountcastle?" I was like, "Oh shit, I forgot about him too." But yeah, Nate Pearson could throw like a million miles an hour. Leody Tavares for the Rangers. Overall, ridiculous rookie class. So, um, don't expect top products, uh, tops products, especially Chrome and stuff like that, to uh, to be any easier to get. Joey Bart, first rookie auto we found of him. Giants, Deborah Close, last spot mojo. Stud. Super underrated. Yeah. Nate Pearson literally can throw like a million miles per hour. And I think he's got like four solid pitches. John Gray, now you got to go for the color, TJ. You got to go for the rainbow. John Gray, black. This one's out of seventy. Now you, you've got the, you've got the Father's Day blue out of fifty. Now you got to go for the full rainbow. It has been decided. This one box decided that for you. 
Yeah, and you know what's funny is like I get that that rookies don't, I mean pitchers don't get enough love or at all anymore, um, but they uh, they with how many good rookies are coming up nowadays. I have a feeling that it's going to swing back towards the love of the pitchers, which is really cool. Cool. Box three. Casey Mai, Sixto Sanchez. Jay Bruce to 199 for the Phillies. Scott Rakefis. Most un. Like, just look at that slide. <laughs> it's not a pretty slide at all. Ryan Mountcastle. That looks like a slide that if like you took a dude and you were like in like a beer league and you're like slide into second. Okay. Ian Anderson, rookie relic, to 99 for the Braves. Eric Ainge. Dylan Carlson for the Cardinals. Christian Pache for the Braves. Juan Soto Gold to 2021. Washington, Super Fractor Hunter. Yeah, we were talking about Sixto Sanchez. We were saying that with how well he's playing, I mean, I know that Phillies needed, really needed JT Real Muto, but I feel like it kind of forced their hand even more. That it was like, you really going to give up Sixto Sanchez and whatever else was part of the trade all for one year of me? It's a rough pill to swallow. Oh yeah, see, good call. I didn't even. I just saw your, uh, your, uh, your thing. Joe and I were actually just talking about that earlier tonight. We were saying the same thing. We were like, honestly, like that with how well Sixto Sanchez has played, we kind of felt like that made it where they had to resign JT Real Muto, or it literally just screwed them.
Jacob DeGrom relic for the Mets. Ross Gimble to 299. Christian Pache. Yeah, no, Christian Javier, it's a, it's a really nice card. Um, the one from, I can't, why can't I think of his name right now? The, uh, the dude from the Nationals. I keep seeing his name. But um, his rookie card actually looks pretty cool. It's uh, it, it looks like him fielding at second and uh, turning to throw to first. I don't think he's in the air. It looks like a really, it's a really cool looking rookie card. So, Andres Jimenez is a good looking one too, right there too. Joey Bart, Dylan Carlson. Right there, Luis Garcia. That's the one I was talking about. So yeah, in the air, fielding a ball, second, throwing the first. Pretty cool looking card. Yeah, there you go, Skiro. Good call. Nick Madrigal, Rookie Gold, 2021. White Sox, Francisco Hernandez. Nick Madrigal. This one's kind of cool, too. Going for the catch. Alec Baum. That one's pretty strong. With a chin protector. He looks like he really digs his chin into that uh into that shoulder. Danny Jansen auto for the Toronto Blue Jays, Richard Zitterman, Joe Adele for the Angels. He looks like he really digs that in when he's like when he's in the box. Dodgers, White Sox. I mean, I'd say those all four of those teams. Uh, don't don't pass on the Blue Jays either, man. Oof. They are doing some work to put that team together. Bobby Dahlbeck. Have you seen the hand sanitizer card? No. Joe Adele. Is it a base card or is it like a short print? I'm guessing it's got to be a short print, right? I mean the Mets, yes, they they could use more bats. But have you seen their pitching, <laughs> their their lineup for pitchers? It's pretty dumb. While vice versa, the Blue Jays. It's a base, huh? Interesting. I don't think so. Not yet, you're saying. Interesting. Interessante. <laughs> so that was box three. Three boxes left, guys. Box four, first half. Yeah, yeah, the Jays, I mean, I think the Mets and the Jays are like the exact opposite of each other. The Mets, ridiculous pitching, right? Could use more bats. The Jays, ridiculous bats, could use more pitching. But, I mean, overall, each one of them is in a good position to compete where they need to.
Nick Madrigal. Alec Baum. Joey Bart. Dylan Carlson. Yeah, I was, I, I was going to say the same thing. Why were you confused by that? It seemed like a pretty decent decent signing, actually. Like a pretty good uh, good pickup by them. Wilson Contreras, gold to 2021 for the Cubs. Gregory Bird, or Broad, sorry. Bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word. Ahmed Rosario, relic for the Mets. Ross Gimble. Uh, Simeon, I think, can also play second, though. Right? Yeah. That's what I was saying. Yeah, I, I think Simeon's at second. I think he was playing shortstop because of necessity in Oakland. Uh, Bobby Dahlbeck, Joe Adele, Casey Mize, Sixto Sanchez. Brandon Nitzler to four ninety nine for the Marlins. Ryan Harold, Alec Baum for the Phillies. Scott Rakefis. Yeah. No, I agree, Shani. I have I I do not disagree with you at all. But I think he's like you said I think he's going to be good wherever they plug him in and if the rest of the pieces are already good where they're at and he's versatile use his versatility and keep the other pieces where they're at. Second half of box 4. Bobby Dahlbeck, Joe Adele, Casey Mize, Kiebert Ruiz, short print, that's a cool looking short print for a rookie, let's see, it's, it's a regular short print, 230, not a super short print, Dodgers, Kenneth Barefoot, and nice Hank Aaron cloth for the Milwaukee Braves, which is the Atlanta Braves, Eric Ainge. Sixto Sanchez. Yeah, RIP. Henry. Hammer. Right. 
I thought the Schwarber deal was a good deal. One year, what was it? One year, ten million. Nothing crazy. Get him for a year though, you know. I thought that was a good deal. Uh, Josh Bell. I don't know what the how to feel about Josh Bell. I never know what to feel about him. Ryan Mountcastle. John Lester, out of 70, for the Cubs, Gregory Broad. Keston Hira, auto, for the Brewers, Brian Wilk. What's the number? Uh, yes, 78 out of 199 on that Keston Hira. Christian Pache. I have Trevor. I have. Either that or I just made it look like that and I waited for you to wake up and come online and see that I was here. And now I'm going to go offline just so you think I was here all night. One of those two options this is a real one. Okay, box number five. Of course. I'm doing everything today. Sixto Sanchez. Four eighty or five a hundred. Ryan Mountcastle. I agree, Shiny. <laughs> That's a lot. 
That's a lot. I can't believe those numbers. I mean, did somebody in his range sign for considerably more? Uh, Luis Garcia, foil. Washington Superfractor Hunter. Jacob, or sorry, Jose Abreu. Gold, 2021. MVP. Uh, White Sox, Francisco Hernandez. Jack Flaherty, relic for the Cardinals. Daniel Yu. Christian Pache. Joey Bart. What does my bracelet say on him? Tops official breaker. Christian Pache. Shohei Otani. To two ninety nine. For the Angels, Alex Valsakos. They only went out for the top trip party, dude. Top flights created to the world, Craig. Of the world. Ooh. Regular short print. Joey Bart. There you go. Giants, short print, Dever Close, last spot Bojo. Got an auto of Joey Bart. Now we got a short print. Let's go Los Gigantes. The Javier insert, yeah, the 86. It's pretty cool looking. Nick Madrigal, Alec Baum, Joey Bart, Dylan Carlson. Still looking for an ultra short print here. Give it to me. Give it.
auto stuck to the back here. Tom Hatch, rookie auto. For the Blue Jays, Richard Zitterman. Bobby Dahlbeck, Joe Adele, Casey Mize, Dalton Varsho, Gold Foil, Diamondbacks, Spiro Valasakos. Wade LeBlanc to 300, advanced stats. Orioles, Richard Zitterman. Joey Bart, Giants. It's box five. One box left, guys. Let's make it memorable. Christian Pache. Cody Ballinger, gold to 2021 for the Dodgers, Kenneth Barefoot, and Lou Bob, relic for the White Sox, Francisco Hernandez, nice pinstripe relic for you. Uh, this is Pick Your Team 3. Nick Madrigal, Alec Baum, Joey Bart, Dylan Carlson, Christian Pache, Gold Foil for the Braves, Eric Gange.
Cool. So, second half of box six, guys. Let's finish it strong. Nick Madrigal, Joey Bart, uh, Dylan Carlson. Buster Posey for the Giants, Deborah Close. Alec Baum. Yeah, they're they're uh, manufactured, but they do look really cool. We got a Willie McCovey to two ninety nine for the Giants. Deborah Close, Casey Mize for the Tigers. Bobby Dahlbeck, Joe Adele, Casey Mize, Sixto Sanchez. Santiago Espanol. Rookie auto for the Blue Jays. And Richard Zitterman. That might be our final auto unless we have one in one of the uh, box toppers. Which I would be okay with. Maybe Lou Bob? Ryan Mountcastle? Joe Adele? Joey Gallo, home run challenge. Matt Olson to 299 for the A's, Rob Hepler. There it is. I did. I did. And Jason will be on shortly. And then uh, he'll be going until Joe gets here at 1. Joe will go 1 to 9. And then I'll be back at 9 o'clock. Cool. Box toppers.
Bobby Dahlbeck, Red Sox. Andres Jimenez, blue to 150. For the Mets, Ross Gimble. Sixto Sanchez for the Marlins, Ryan Harold. Nick Madrigal for the White Sox, Francisco Hernandez. Joey Bart for the Giants, Deborah Close. Alec Baum for the Phillies, Scott Rakefis. Bobby Dahlbeck again for the Red Sox, Alex Valasakos. Randy Johnson to 75, purple for the Dimebacks, Spiro Falasakos. And there you go. Now, the box toppers. Mike Trout for the Angels. Alex Valasakos. Nolan Arenado for the Rockies. Tom Jones. Garrett Cole for the Yankees. Russell Thompson. Fernando Tatis Jr. For the Padres, Brian Peoples. Cody Bellinger. For the Dodgers, Kenneth Barefoot. And our final one, Chris Bryant. For the Cubs and Gregory Broad. There you go. Let's do the randomizer for the Topps Rip Party Pack. And a recap. So here is the original list. No, did I not copy it in? I thought I did. Cool, so let's copy the list from Spiro and the Diamondbacks down to Superfractor Hunter, the Nationals. There you go. Superfractor back up to Spiro. Dice roll. Name on top after a two and a two four times for the hard way. Gets the top rip party pack. Number two on the list will get any and all non-team cards, so those tops cards. So four. Fourth and final time. Spiro Valasakos on top. You get that pack. Rob Hepler. You get the non-team associated cards. Four times on the randomizer. Four times on the dice. Back up to the top. And there you go. Congrats, Spiro. So Spiro with the Rip Party Pack. And Rob non-team cards. There you go. Now, let's do a little recap for ourselves. Randy Johnson, Santiago Espinal, Buster Posey, Luis Robert, Shohei Otani, Joey Bart, short print, Tom Hatch, Jack Flaherty, Keeper Reese short print, 
Hank Aaron. Keston Gira, John Lester, Ahmed Rosario, Jacob DeGrom, Danny Jansen, Ian Anderson, Francisco Lindor, John Gray out of 50, John Gray out of 70, Joey Bart, rookie auto, Paul DeYoung, Sam Huff, rookie auto, Shane Bieber, Juan Soto, and John Lester, short print. There you go, guys. That is the recap. That was 2021 Tops Series 1 Jumbo 6 Box Case Break. Pick your team number three from jaspyscasebreaks.com. I'm Sean, jaspyscasebreaks.com. Thanks for hanging out. See you next time.